Why do you not speak louder? She said to Susan B. I speak as loudly as I can. I even speak louder. I even speak louder than I can. Do you really? Said Anne. Yes, I really do. Said Susan B. It was dark, and as it was dark, it was necessary to speak louder or very softly. Very softly. Because she was right. Susan B was right. She was right because she was right. It is easy to be right. Everybody else is wrong. So it is easy to be right. Susan B was right. Of course she was right. It is easy to be right. Everybody else is wrong. It is easy to be right. And in a way, yes, in a way, yes, really, in a way. In a way, really, in a way, it is useful to be right. But it does if you are right. It is very remarkable. No, it is not very remarkable, said Susan B. It is not very remarkable, really, said Anne. And said Susan B. That is what I mean by. In a little while, they found everything very mixed. It is not really mixed. How 
Can anything be really mixed when men are so conservative, dull, monotonous to say it, stupid, unchanging in bodies? Oh, how when men are men, can they be mixed? Yes, yes, men are men, how can they? When men are men, how can they be mixed? How can they? They listen to me, always listen to me. the poor persecutor Why? if money is money is it money money Why? pity the poor persecutor Why? is money money or is it money money Why? pity the poor persecutor because Why? the poor persecutor always got to be poor Why? Because is money money or is it money money? That's why when the poor persecutor is persecuted, why? he has to cry. Why? Because the persecutor why? always why? and by why? being why? persecuted, why? that why? is the reason why. That is the reason why. He ticked a pit, he ticked it deep, he ticked it for his brother into the pit he did fall in the pit he digged for his brother Daniel was my father's name father's name father's name my father's name was Daniel not Daniel not Daniel in the lion's den my father's name was Daniel And B. Anthony is that kind of a name. But my name is Indiana Elliot. What's in a name? Everything. My father's name was Daniel. He had a black beard. He was not tall at all. He had a black beard, his name was Daniel. Not Daniel, not Daniel. Not Daniel, not Daniel in the lion's den, not Daniel. Oh. 
She your wife? Yes, when she was funny. How funny? Very funny. Very funny. To be funny, you have to take everything in the kitchen and put it on the floor. You have to take all your money and all your jewels and put them near the door. You have to go to bed then and leave the door open. That is the way you do when you are funny. Was oh, she funny? Yes, she was funny. Eisenhower, yes, he knew it. He did know it. He asked me to come. He did ask me. I chose a long time. Yes, I took a very long time to choose. Yes, I did. They missed the boat. Yes, they did. They missed the boat. I came again, but not when I was expected. But yes, when I was expected, because they did expect me. I came to dinner. Is, I don't know what a mouse is. What is a mouse? I'm a mouse. Well, yes, well. All right, well, well, what is a mouse? I'm a mouse. Well, if you are, what is a mouse? You know what a mouse is. I am a mouse. Yes, well, and she. I feel so. Yes, well. Do not hear a sound when I am told. Silence! <laughs> Mariner 
has been tossed for many days in thick weather and on an unknown sea. He naturally avails himself of the first pause in the storm. For instance, they should always fight. They should be mortals. Some should be mortals. Are they? Are they? We have thus heard, sir, what a resolution is. When this debate, sir, was to be resumed on Thursday, it so happened that it would have been convenient for me to be elsewhere. I am here, ready to be here, ready to be here, ready to be here, it is my habit. The honorable member complained that I had slept on his speed. The right to sleep is given to no woman. Matches and overmatches. I understand that you undertake to overthrow the undertaking. I can tell the honorable member once for all that she is greatly mistaken and that he is dealing with one of whose temper and character she has yet much to learn. I have declared that patience is never more than patient. I too have declared that all are not patient. What interest asks he has South Carolina in a canal in Ohio? What interest have they in me? What interest have I in them? Who the head of whom? Who can bite their lips to avoid a swan? The harvest of neutrality had been great, but we had gathered it all. Not by shade, not by heat, not by joy. I always know that I know to know, rather not to know. Yes, and I do not stop, but I know not to know. Yes, now, yes, now. I have never asked anyone to forgive me. On yet another point, I was still more unaccountably misunderstood. Do we do what we have to do, or do we have to do what we do? I answer, Mr. President, I shall enter on no encomium upon Massachusetts. She needs none. There she is. Behold her and judge for yourselves. I entered to a tabernacle. I was born a believer in this. I say fight for the right. Be a martyr and live. Be a coward and die. I did not misunderstand me. I should believe what they ask, but they know. It has been to us all a copious fountain of national, social, and personal happiness. Whoa.
about mice. I am talking about a mouse. I like a mouse. I hate a mouse. No. Public school education. I do not believe in Freemasons. I believe in public school education. I do not believe that everyone can always do whatever he likes. I have not always done what I like. But I would if I could, and so I will. I will do what I will. I will have my will. That is my decision. Father, your decision. I tell you it is cold weather in winter wherever I am. Antagonizes is a pleasant name. Antagonizes is a pleasant meat. Antagonizes is a Constance Fletcher, it is a great pleasure that I kneel at your feet. But I am an Adams, I kneel at the feet of none, not anyone. Dear Miss Constance Fletcher, dear, dear Miss Constance Fletcher, I kneel at your feet before. I would have kneeled at your feet and kissed my hand and kissed your hand. What a pity! No, not what a pity! It is not a soul, but what a pity! What a pity it is! What a pity! Do not pity me, kind. A lovely Miss Constance Fletcher. Do not pity me, no, do not pity me. I am an Adams and not pitiable. Dear, dear me, if he had not been an Adams, he would have kneeled at my feet and he would have kissed my hand. You have kissed my hand or my hands, dear Mr. Adams. I mean that I would have first kneeled at your feet and then I would have kissed one of your hands and then I would Yeah. <laughs> 
parting Isabel Wentworth. Why shouldn't everybody forget Isabel Wentworth? Well, that is just what I want to know. I just want to know if everybody has forgotten Isabel Wentworth. That is all I want to know. I just want to know if everybody has forgotten Isabel Wentworth. You are awake, Susan B. Of the VIP, very important persons to anyone. 
coat and hear and see. We are the chorus of the VIP. between rich and poor, poor and rich. No use to ask the VIP. They never answer me, but you to be so rich that when they are rich they have it to be that they do not listen and when they do they do not hear and to be poor to be poor is to be so poor they listen and listen and what they It is to be poor, but oh, 
had a pen that was to have ink for a year, and it only lasted six weeks. Yes, I know, I
and mine is too large. Hush. I wish my name was Adams. Hush. I never marry. I have been twice divorced, but I have never married. Constance Fletcher, Constance Fletcher, do you not admire me that I can never marry So beautiful, it is so beautiful to meet you here, so beautiful, so beautiful to meet you here. Having joined, have separated, and not having separated, have led, and not having led, have thundered. When I, having thundered, have provoked, and having provoked, have dominated. Not kneel at your feet, because I cannot kneel. My knees are not kneeling knees, but dear angel more, be my angel more forever more. Join the choir that is visible. is visible is as visible as what angel more as visible as visible do you not hear me as visible you do not and I do not what? separate marriage from marriage As long as I sit, I am sitting silent again as you were. You were all silent. As long as I sit, I am sitting. knows who I am, but I forbid the marriage. Do we know whether Joe the loiterer is a bigamist, or a grandfather, or an uncle, or a refugee? Do we know? No, we do not know. And I forbid the marriage. I forbid it. I am Indiana Elliot's brother, and I forbid it. I am known as Herman Atlin, and I forbid it. I am known as Anthony Comstock, and I forbid it. I am Indiana Elliot Brother, and I forbid it. Well, 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 I knew that ring of mine was too large. It could not fall off on account of my joints, but I knew it was too large. I renounce my brother. That's right, my dear, that's all right. What is marriage? Is marriage protection? Or religion? Is marriage renunciation? Or abundance? Is marriage a stepping stone? I do not 
not slight noise. I do not slight cannonballs. I do not slight storms. I do not slight talking. I do not slight noise. I like everything and everybody to be silent. Everybody be silent. I know I was silent. Everybody can tell just by listening to me just how silent I am. Dear General, dear General Ulysses, dear General Ulysses, Zeus and Grant, am I not the perfect example of what you like? Am I not silent? I am not free, and the reason why is that I have had to do what I have had to do. I have had to be what I have had to be. I could never be more than two. I could never be two. But not, not I. Not I. Why don't you? Because I am here.
is white, and soldiers drink and fight, and I am still alive. They want you, and they will want you again. Yes, I know, they love me so, they tell me so, they tell me so, but I, I do not tell them. to die, but they will not have died, what I need to have done, to make it right, that I lived my life and fight. Indiana Elliot wants to come in. She will not take my name. She says it is not all the same. She says that she is Indiana Elliot, and that I am Joe, and that she will not take my name, and that she will always tell me so. Oh, yes, she is right. Of course, she is right. It is not all the same. Indiana Elliot is her name. She is only married to me. There is no difference that I can see. But all the same, there she is. And she will not change her name. Yes, it is all the same. Come or not come, it 
Thanks, we all know the 
But whatever happens, we all can depend upon you to do your best for any cause, which is a cause. And any cause is a cause. And because any cause is a cause, therefore you will always do your best for this cause. Our cause.
sees an eagle, but she's only afraid for her children. They are afraid for themselves. That is the real difference between them and women. But Susan G., why do you not say these things out loud? <laughs> why not? Because if I did, they would not listen. They not alone would not listen. They would revenge themselves. Men have kind hearts when they are not afraid, but they are afraid. Afraid, afraid. I say they are afraid. But if I were to tell them so, their kindness would turn to hate. Yes. The Quakers are right. They are not afraid because they do not fight. They do not fight! <gasps> Susan, you fight and you are not afraid. They fight and you are not afraid. They fight and you are not afraid.
What, what is it? What is it? What is the false and the true? And I say to you, Susan B. Anthony, you know the false from the true. And yet you will not wait, you will not wait. When my eyes, and I have eyes, when my eyes, beyond that I seek not to penetrate the veil. Why should you? What what you have chosen when my eyes why could you want that the curtain may rise when my eyes why should the vision be open to what lies behind? Why Susan be Anthony fight the fight that is the fight that any fight may be a fight for the right. I hear that you say that the word male should not be written into the Constitution of the United States of America, but I say, I say, that so long that the gorgeous ensign of the Republic still full high advanced its arms and trophies streaming in their original luster not a stripe erased or polluted not a single star of she has decided to change her name It is his name, but it is such a pretty name. The loiterer is such a pretty name. I think all the same, he will have to change his name. He must be Joe Elliot, yes. It is what he has to do. He has to be Joe Elliot, and I am going to be Indiana Loiterer. All right, I never fight. Nobody will know it's me. But what can I do if I am not she and I am not me? What can I do if a name is not true? What can I do but do as she tells me? She is quite right. Not she, but nobody, no, nobody ever wants to listen to me.
successful day every day every day to interrupt. 
Jones. Either one or the other married must be canonical. Either one or the other. If either one or the other of a married couple are economical, then a marriage is successful. If not, not. I have a great deal to say about marriage. And dear Susan Ripley was ever married. How wonderful. It is to be never married. Oh, wonderful. I have a great deal to say about marriage. Last but not least, first and not best, I am poor as a man, I am firm as a clam, and I never change from day to day. And sing Christy Chris, wet and not in debt. I am a married man, and I know how I show I am a married man. She votes, she changes her name, and she votes, she votes. Do 